What do you want, kid? Mr. M, do you believe in coincidences? What? I mean, what are the chances that you're born into the same place, same time, same level range as another person? Are you insane? What are you yammering about? Maybe there's a reason. Maybe there's someone you always see, always run into, always talk to, all for a greater purpose. Maybe it's fate. Fate? That's right. Fate. Yeah. You're getting detention. Fate, Mr. M. You can't escape fate. Who has fate conspired to bring you close to? Think about it. And farewell. Hey! Get back here, you little... Um, what was that all about? Fate, huh? Hmm. Can't believe I survived that. I fought bosses scarier than him. Not sure how I'll go with Miss Hill, though. I'm not sure I get her yet. I remember you. You came here last time with a sprained ankle. Did you hurt yourself again in PE? No, I think today it was the lunch. Oh, let me get the disinfectant. What? Right. Say, I was wondering, how old are you? Early 20s, right? <laughs> no. What? <laughs> no, no, dear. I'll be 30 soon. Hilla blushes. Here, take some antacids. You know I'm just kidding with the disinfectant bit, right? She's obviously well over 30. Thanks! I thought you were a student at first. So does that make you the youngest teacher at school? Or is that Mr. Magnus? Um, sure. Whatever you say. They say it's easy to find true love around 30. Old enough to know what you want, young enough to enjoy it. Uh... That's just what I hear, though. <laughs> My stomach feels a lot better. I think I'll be going. Uh... Okay, yeah. Wait a minute. You and Mr. Magnus are about the same age. What? Uh, oh, yeah. That's very interesting. My parents are four years apart, you know. My cousin is getting married to someone four years older than her. Uh... Okay, thanks again. See ya. Um, are you delusional? Hmm. Plot device, where have you been? Oh man, listen to this. You explain what you told Magnus and Hilla. Fate? Four years apart? Where did you come up with this junk? I nabbed a magazine from Cygnus' office. Good stuff. Come on, let's finish this. Finish this? Get 
ready, bros. They're coming. <laughs> hey, uh, you guys know that Orchid never forgets a face after she sees them, right? Yes, she never forgets. But for some reason, she can't remember Miss Hilla or Mr. Magnus. Oh. What? That's so weird! It must be... fate. Uh... Oh. Huh? Jackpot, my brothers! Jackpot! Did you see that? They totally notice each other! We did it! Man, I guess we're pretty great actors. Maybe we should try out for the play. How come I didn't get any lines? Huh? Uh, I'm never doing anything like that ever again. That was fun! So, um, what's next? Time for the final strike. It is common for people to fall in love during these times of crisis. The intense pressure leads to intense feelings. First, we have to get Mr. Magnus into the school infirmary to get them both in one place. The question is how? That's a tough one. I heard that flu virus was the first time he ever got sick. He's too healthy. I still have some laxatives from when I was sick. I could knock him out. I've had a lot of practice at that kind of thing. Huh? huh? Mr. Magnus is at the front gate. How best to do this? Mr. Magnus! What? You again? Sorry about this. What? Um, can I borrow some soccer balls? Huh? It depends. How many? Uh, around a hundred. Beat Teacher Magnus with soccer balls. life in detention ah he's too strong this won't do uh, <laughs> at last my time has I'm hanging up oh hey wait don't just call me off like that not a good time Francis I want I just want to help I looked up another charm that... I'm hanging up. Fine, fine. Look, 
Plot device, have you completed your mission? The captain requires your report. No good. I pegged him with a ton of soccer balls and he didn't budge. He's like a dragon. Then it's my turn to shine. Come to the science lab on the third floor. I'll show you the power of chemistry. Science lab? Why? Oh good, you're here. I didn't do it. He was mixing some kind of potion, I think. And then... There was an explosion and he passed out. Totally wasn't me. It's the moats again. Don't know if they caused the explosion, but I'm sure they had something to do with it. You gotta take him out. Hunt 90 moats in the dust zone of the science lab. Are they gone? I think I might be allergic. Achoo! Good. The last thing we need now is a troublemaker. Oh good, he's coming around. Hey, wake up. Oh, five more minutes, Mom. I don't want breakfast. Hey, I'm not your mom. Get up. The science lab. So you've discovered my hidden sanctum, but here are my dark powers, uh... Francis, stop. You're giving me flashbacks. Now, you said there's a way to make Mr. Magnus pass out? You're so catty these days. Okay, fine. I got what you need over there. Have him drink this, so we'll put him down for sure. This stuff looks and smells dangerous. Bring it to Magnus at the front gate. Mr. Magnus! You again? You're really pushing your luck, kid. I know, and I'm sorry. I want to make it up to you. Oh yeah? How are you gonna do that? With this energy drink. Got it just for you. Oh. Alright. Thanks. This better not have laxative or something in it. Well, that was quick. Remind me never to make Francis mad. Alright, time to get him to the school infirmary. Oh my gosh, what happened to him? He looks like he could swallow concrete and be totally fine. Um, I think it's, uh, heat stroke? The weather these days, um, I gotta go. We'll just lock this up tight. Gotta get to the power box on the school roof. Lights out! You may get scolded if you mess with this circuit breaker. Did you lock the doors to the school infirmary? Uh-huh. I also tossed the key and cut the power. So, you think this will really bring them together? 
One way to find out. Let's check the surveillance camera in there. We'll at least hear what they're saying. Oh, now the power's out? Oh. Yeah. Magnus? Yeah. Excuse me, what? Hurts. So much. You're hurt? Really? I mean, I have to be honest, I didn't think that was possible. Ha! Ha! Don't be such a big baby, Magnus. I'm here. H Hilla. Relax. I'll get you something for the pain. I'll take care of you. It's working! Oh dang, it's working! Okay, one thing left. Nine man, what was it? The confession. Wow, can't believe we got this far. It is pretty incredible, I admit. But we're not quite there yet. We need them to admit their feelings. But Orchid is still... I even did a proper... How do you plan to do that? There are three parts for a proper confession of love. A private location, romantic music, and a special event. Let's look for the location first. You all heard him! Mikao and I will search the school! Nine heard and Francis, check the neighborhood! Plot device, bro! See where you can find the city! We almost got this, players! Keep it up! Go! Search the empty lots first. There's absolutely nothing here. This place is more fit for a fight. I need to keep looking. This place is pretty nice. Good for a walk. Might be too romantic. This place can be a backup. Fountain. Hey, this might work. I need to call the other players. What's the word, bro? I'm at the Fountain Park. This place looks pretty good. You should come check it out. Good call, plot device. We'll meet you there. I thought all the teachers were meeting here for an outing. That's what I heard too. Guess everyone else is too busy. Why are you still in your gym clothes? Why are you in a gown? Ugh. Uh... <laughs> never mind. Yeah, never mind. Now, do it. Go, Francis! You play that romantic music! Got it, bro. What's this music? Oh man, oh man, wrong track, wrong track! Ah. Again, again! Whoa. Oh! My heart is... Beating so fast! Magnus. Hilla. Oh yeah! Nailed it! I can't believe this is working! Could it be they... If these two can hook up, 
There's still a chance for me and Orchid. There. Now maybe I can get back to my normal life. And what are you two doing here? Mr. Arcarium? This is an awfully suspicious meeting, you two. We heard there was a faculty outing here. I heard nothing of the sort. But come to think of it, I've heard plenty about you two lately. Are the rumors true? No, never! I wouldn't, not with... He's such a... a brute! Hey, hey, hey! Maybe I wouldn't, with... Dolled up dits! Gah, we were so close! We can back down now! Plot device, get out there! We'll follow Hilda and Magnus! Go team! No, can't be. I can't be single forever. No, I tried so hard. A troublemaker? Where are Elwyn and Lily at times like this? I mean, not that they really do anything. His loneliness seems to have built over time to form this troublemaker. Aww, my eyes are leaking. Where are Hilla and Magnus? Sorry, plot device. They found us. We blew it. It's true. Hawkeye blew it. He was acting out and Miss Hilla caught us in the act. We were so close. Their relationship will surely be worse now. I guess the no-dating policy at the school isn't going anywhere for some time. No! But Orchid! I'm gonna head back. This was pretty nuts, but I have to admit, it was fun. Wait up, bro! I'm gonna need a wingman after all this excitement, yo! I need to find my doll. I will see you all later. Much later. No, they can't be dating. They don't even have white hair. Huh? idea that could happen. Born single? That sounds so sad. Anyway, good work handling that yourself. I feel pretty good about our mission here. Do you know why we have so many ghosts at our school? There is a reason for everything. What I am about to tell you is the absolute truth. 